The Innocence is a performance art piece that we created in 2006 for an exhibit of photography by Taryn Simon at the uh, Cincinnati Contemporary Arts Center. The piece is centered on the issue of wrongful imprisonment and exoneration through DNA, uh, similar to the work of the Innocence Project, a very well-known and active social justice organization. The Innocents, a few of whose stories are told in this project, serve collectively, depending upon how you can best imagine the unimaginable, 4,762 years in American prisons for crimes they did not commit. We felt that uh, as musicians, as, as artists, we wanted to bring the thing that we are best at, the kind of creativity where we are actually most comfortable in our element, bring that to bear on an issue which our society has to look at. You can read about it in the newspaper, you can read it all online all the time, find all the facts and figures. It doesn't actually touch us in the same way that throughout all of history, artists have been able to shine a light on some kind of issue of their times and make us feel, um, feel what it might be like to be in those situations. So John and I have found many different kinds of music, many different ways to actually touch on different aspects of this problem. That incident that happened that night, change for the better, somehow happens to write using her own blood shot family member under pressure, not because one planned to revise to a... As we've performed this piece over the last 12 years, we've become more and more aware of the issue. Our performances have put us in direct contact with exonerees whose lives were affected by this issue, have put us in contact with lawyers who are actively working to affect change in the criminal justice system. It's put us in contact with the Innocence Project. And I feel like we have a much deeper investment in this issue and an understanding of all the things that, that go on. And I feel like our role in all of that has been one of advocacy. I think it's been tremendously helpful to us, even, even moving for us, to be encouraged not only by the lawyers but by the exonerees themselves. Sometimes we've felt that doing this kind of work, may, maybe we should actually be just um, volunteering our time uh, in, in the offices where people are actually doing the DNA testing and uh, such things. In every case, these people have said, no, be, be artists, be musicians, do what you do. We need advocacy in all areas of this issue, and it brings the issue to many, many more people simply by using your own means to do it.